finally heading out of Puerto Natales, which is pretty epic because we crossed into the country and we turned right. And today we finally made it back to that road. There's no other way to go south. If you go right, you get Torres de Maine, which we love. That Rio Serrano spot was so amazing. You know, most recently we went down there to that Seno Obstrucción, the sound where the end of the road was. This area is just really beautiful because you got the mountains, you got the sound, and I wanted to spend some good time there. It's time to head to Punta Arenas. So, you know, we're once again crossing this vast, empty Patagonian desert. And fortunately along the way, you know, this is actually our third time coming this road. <laughs> but we're doing things we haven't done before, showing you guys the cool stuff. And there's something I've always wanted to do on this road. Just in the middle of this flatness, there is this huge hill. And I was thinking every time we pass it, like, I want to climb that thing one day. And I've been talking to Catherine and Klaus and Emily about it. And, um, you know, Klaus said, well, you know, we'll see it. We'll see if it's a good day. And turns out we have the best day we've had, <laughs> pretty much. So I think we're going to do this hike. I learned now it's actually an extinct volcano. So that's why around it is completely flat and you have the inside of the volcano that's only what's left, which is just like Devil's Tower in Wyoming. Devil's Tower is even more spectacular than this hill over here. But it's really cool just being the highest thing with nothing around. So we've made it to our campsite here in Punta Renas. We we're planning on sharing dinner with our friends and then we're all going to watch the TV show that we've been watching together, Last of Us. We've been loving it. Good morning. We have some huge plans today. We are going to head into town to pick up the side panel that we actually lost when we were going down a dirt road and we don't actually know where we lost it but it was above the driver's side back tire so we're gonna go pick up that today in Punta Arenas. It's so clean. Look compared how to, clean that is. Compared to ours. Oh that's it guys. Oh my god it's gonna look so funny with how dirty everything else is. That's the right <laughs> so it came with these connectors so I think you take these off. After that, we're going to head over to Tierra del Fuego Island. We've been here before. We've explored this place so heavily, but we're actually going to be taking a different ferry than we took the last time. This ferry is actually going to go through the middle of the Magellan Strait, whereas last time we kind of went through the top of it. And we're taking this one because on the other side, on Tierra del Fuego Island, there is a king penguin colony we are so excited to check out. We haven't really seen that many penguins here on South on the South American continent. We did see them in Antarctica, but we haven't seen these types of penguins either. So it'll be sweet to see these guys over yes. here on the continent. Oh my god! Have to be quiet while we're around the colony so that we don't disturb them. We didn't see them in Antarctica because they typically stay between 45 and 55 degrees south. So we will get to see them again in the Falklands and South Georgia on the cruise coming up. And they also look very similar to the biggest penguins, which are emperor penguins that live inland on Antarctica. We paid 12,000 Chilean pesos each to do this tour, which is only around $12 US. They take great care of the place with a nice trail and viewing areas, signs that are in English and Spanish. Um, it was a bit out of the way, but it was still a really awesome place. And that's really where animals like to be, where people don't usually head.
So we're actually running low on time before we make it to Ushuaia to get to the ship. So we're just going to head straight to the border this afternoon and right to the end of the world after that. Uh, but I'm so excited to bring you guys along next time to see our temporary home for a little while. If you like this video, make sure to let us know in the comments, like and subscribe. And if you want to help us out a little bit more, head over to our Patreon. We'll see you guys next time. Thank you.